Hi everyone, and welcome to another video on how to use chess.com. In today's video, we're gonna be discussing how the new settings and flipboard features are universal to every board and platform you see on the new chess.com. Here in the live chess arena, as Fabiana Caruana just won a very nice game against Grandmaster Wei Yi, we see that we can adjust the settings by scrolling over the resize board button, which I've already showed in many of the other tutorials. And now the flipboard and settings button magically appear. Why do we have them only appear if you scroll over the resize board button? That's actually by design, so that if you're in a blitz or bullet game, or even in a daily chess game, you don't accidentally click on your settings or flipboard. These magical invisible little figurines only show up when you scroll your mouse over the resize board, and once again we see them appear, allowing us to flip the board and pull up the settings specific to that platform. That's important because if I click on the settings here, not only can I adjust the board design and everything that I would do in live chess, but it brings up all of my live chess specific settings, enabling pre-moves, auto queen promotion, etc. Then when you're on the main site, whether that be daily chess, once again, we see that I scroll my mouse over and I can now flip the board as well as pull up the settings. Or in tactics trainer, which is also the same thing, I, I scroll my mouse over and now I can flip the board and pull up the settings. The main site, that would be Daily Chess, Tactics Trainer, Opening Studies, just about anything you might see that involves a board under the Learn menu, is the same platform, so that you can browse and use the same board style, whatever you might want that to be. Here we see it's blue, and if I go into my Daily Chess game and refresh, you'll see that my board will now be blue. So the main site's features, both Daily Chess, Tactics, and like I said, other Learn tools that have a board, are all universal, allowing you to change to the style you like with just one click. And the live chess features remain on their own platform, but the universal tools are found, once again, by scrolling your mouse over the resize board button, and then choosing either flipboard or settings as your heart desires. Thanks for watching.